Okay, Shahana, uh, it's Dave at David Bruce again. I guess this is take two uh, on the Prius 2012. This is the winter gray and it has a bit more equipment, which I'll show you. Look at the body and everything on this one. Uh, the tires and wheels, plenty of tread left on that. No dents or major dings as well. Very nice color too, especially sitting here in the sunlight. You can see, uh, if you notice those things on the bottom, those are called lower lower door moldings. Uh, gives it a little bit of an accent, has the hybrid name there. Just a nice little chrome accent uh, to go along the whole side of the vehicle. Uh, the other thing this one has, really, really sweet feature. This is a solar panel that goes across the top of the moonroof. And then this is, I'm sorry, the roof of the car. And then this is the moonroof that would actually uh, let the light through and open. There's a little AC button on the remote. That'll actually use the power of the solar roof to ventilate the car. It's got the same smart key that we showed you in the first one. So you don't have to take your key out of a purse or a, <clears throat> or a pocket. Nice and clean. No smoke smell in this one either. Again, the seats fold down in a 60-40 type split. All the original mats. The cargo tray again. Oh, there we go. Just have the cargo tray underneath. Both of these would be excellent choices. Uh, it's just a matter of what you prefer as far as equipment level, color maybe. But two both beautiful cars that'll save you a lot of money in gas and reliable. Hold up in their value and very, very low cost to maintain. The interior is very clean, no rips or tears as I mentioned before. And then let's go ahead and hop in the driver's seat and I'll show you some of the different features that this one has that the other one didn't. So let's get you here in the driver's seat. Okay. Also you see down here that little ventilated button. That does the same thing that the button on my remote does. So I can ventilate the car from inside as well. Again, power button, foot on the brake, push it in, power button goes green. There it is, we're started. Okay, all of our information up there again. Those uh, switches, I call them, where it shows where your fingers are, that has that as well. What's really nice about this one too, it does have the controls for the hands-free Bluetooth, but it's also got voice commands. And the voice commands will go with the audio. So if I'm listening to FM or XM or AM, I can control it or my GPS. Underneath the apps button, I do have a bunch of apps like Pandora, Bing, Movie, ta movie Tickets, Open Table, and whatnot. I can press map, it doesn't cost anything. It uses my GPS on a nice big screen, and I can push my command button here, and then say something like, find next Applebee's. Select a line number, or say correction. One. Line one. Because she needed clarification. Multiple entries for Applebee's. Select a line number, or say correction. One. Line one. That's because there's multiple entries, Applebee's. depending how far I want to travel. Now, do you want to start route guidance? Yes. Starting route guidance. And it would take me to the nearest Applebee's. Now the other thing that I find it useful for, I'm just going to stop this guidance. Usually you know the address of where you're going. So you can hit the command button and then just say something like this. Destination 1465 Derby Drive, Bourbonnet, Illinois. I put my finger along that so you could sort of read along. You don't have to touch it at all. One, four, six, five, Derby Drive, Bourbonnet. And if she needed clarification, 
east, west, north. I could have done that. Yes. So, very easy system to use. Uh, so this is a difference up here versus the other one that we were in. And then you have the same temperature controls for all digital climate. You have the same three modes for the EV, Eco, and Power mode. Hopefully you're watching the silver one first. I didn't want to go over all of that uh, again and bore you. Uh, but you have the same controls for your temperature and for the volume and everything for your hands-free phone use. Uh, hopefully between the two of these gives you a little better idea of uh, just which one would work best for you. Uh, give me a call again. Once again, the number 815-260-7887. Thank you very much, Johanna, and we'll talk to you soon.